All right, we're here with Andrea today, and we're going to work on some pelvic stabilizing exercises for pregnant women and men. So first thing we're going to do is do what we call a step up here. We're going to use a six inch box here, vibration platform, or a step at your house as well too. And all she's doing with her hands is stabilizing herself. She's driving a weight through her heel as she comes up here. So one more time there, back up, and she's using her glute to do that. When she does it from this other angle, notice her hip does not go up and does not go down. The belt line stays level the entire way through there. So that's one thing on there. Now we're gonna move to this balance pad here. Same type of thing, we're using a glute to stabilize. It's a static hold, you can do it for 10 to 30, 10 to 30 seconds of pop on something like that. We don't wanna raise the hip too high. We don't want to drop the hip down on the other side as well either because you're not using the right stabilizing muscles in that case. So one side and switch to the other side. Real simple with that. So next thing we're going to do, we're going to go up against the wall here. We're going to do a pelvic tilt. So she's about a foot distance away with her feet. You can see a little bit of daylight through the back through there. She's going to flatten her sp spine to the door or the wall and then back out to the wall, back out three to five seconds holding on that. You can do that about 15 to 20 times. Next thing we're gonna do is on a wobble chair or a wobble disc over here. It's just an inflated balance disc on a hard surface chair. It's gonna work side to side, front to back, and a little bit across the front as well too with their hips. And it's designed to engage that lower core set of muscles. Again, that creates more pelvic stability. The last thing we're gonna do is pelvic tilts on the table here or lying down on your floor at home is fine either way same thing we're going to do a little bit of gap underneath her, her spine and we're going to flatten to the table back up flatten to the table back up relax there now we're going to do a hip extension here so pushing through the heels picking her pelvis up flat level from her hips all the way to her knees through there back down under control back up back down under control, you can a little bit of two second hold and we're back, back down on there. You can do that about, again, five reps of that easily, if not 10 reps of something like that. And that was less than two minutes and 30 seconds to go through all that type of stuff. So take that, use it, good luck to you.